measure out one and a half cups of walnuts and finely grind them in your processor. Set the bowl aside. Next, separate two eggs. Set those aside. In your processor, place two sticks of softened cut up butter. Add two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Next, add in the two egg yolks. Then a half a cup of light brown sugar and a quarter of a cup of confectioner's sugar. Cream that together. Once that's nicely creamed together, add in the flour. Add in two cups of unbleached flour. Press this on low until a dough forms. Transfer the dough to a bowl. It will be very soft. Cover it with a piece of plastic wrap and chill for 30 minutes. After the dough is chilled, using a teaspoon, take some of the dough, roll it into a ball. Slightly beat the egg whites. Take the rolled balls, toss them into the egg whites, and then into the finely ground walnuts and place them on your cookie sheet. You can roll and dip several pieces at a time. Make sure you've preheated your oven to 375 degrees. Using the back of a round measuring spoon, make indentations into the cookies. Place into the oven for 15 to 20 minutes or until lightly browned. Place on the middle shelf. After the cookies have baked for about five to six minutes, you will see that they begin to puff up. Just go back in and press down the centers again. Them back in the oven finish baking after baking for about 20 minutes cookies are nicely browned gently move them to a cooling rack have cooled you can begin filling them with your jelly. I like to use apricot preserves but you can also use unseeded raspberry jam or anything else you'd like. By teaspoonfuls begin filling your cookies. <laughs> 